Kathy, really tough weekend, but I think you're proud of the effort that your team put out there here in Prague. Oh, I'm extremely proud of all four girls, not just for their effort, but for the whole week of preparation, um, the team camaraderie, the team atmosphere, really looking after each other. Um, it's just been an amazing week. Can you detail for us, I mean, Sophia Kennan, it felt like she was down out of that match a dozen different times, but she kept fighting. She really kept herself in that match, just couldn't quite cross the finish line. Well, that's Sonia Kennan for you. I mean, I've known her since she was seven years old. You know exactly what you're going to get with her. She's a fighter. She's tough. Um, you know, I feel terrible for her because she was so close in both matches and getting two wins for us. But she's going to learn so much from this. And uh, what an incredible match that was. I'm just so proud of both players um, because, uh, you know, they just left it all out there, both of them. So um, I'm just happy to be a part of that. This was a team that obviously had its challenges coming in, but you walk away from this weekend feeling what about this group of girls? Well, I mean, I believed in these girls when we walked in. Um, you know, I really thought um, that they could do something. I know that they're tough competitors. Um, I know that they're great uh, young ladies and that the team chemistry was going to be good. So, um, you know, the challenges were, yes, the Czech Republic has a tough team, um, and uh, we knew that coming in, but I also believed in our players. How do you put into words the legacy that Petr Pala continues to build a sixth title in eight years for the Czech Republic? Yeah, it's amazing. Congratulations um, to him. It's, uh, it's a pleasure to compete against him and against this team. Um, they have so many great players like the U.S. and uh, the strength and the depth um, all the way down, and they have young players still coming up. Um, I think we're going to probably battle and hopefully battle for years to come, but congratulations to him and his team. They're incredible. The sportsmanship was great this week, and I'm um, really proud of both teams. And, Captain, obviously not the result you wanted this weekend, but where does the U.S. Fed Cup team go from here moving forward? Well, we start off um, our 2019 uh, campaign in Asheville at home, Asheville, uh, North Carolina. So we're really um, excited about that. And, um, yeah, and we're, uh, we're going to be ready to go. And we play Australia. It's going to be a tough one, but uh, we're looking forward to it. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you.